What is poppin' guys? My name is Alex. Welcome back to a brand new Vegas AT tutorial. In this video, I'm gonna show you the second YouTuber effects pack that you can download completely for free in the description. And first of all, before I'm gonna show you this pack, I want to address something. So in the first video that you guys can also check out, I received a lot of comments from people saying the link is not there, it's clickbait, all of that. But I checked it out myself and it wasn't in fact there. That was true. So I checked on the description, I then reinserted the link. And then of course, I just saved the whole thing. Then maybe after a couple hours or a day, the link just magically disappears. I don't know what it is. I think I inserted maybe the link two or three times myself again, but it still keeps disappearing. So right now I reinserted it again through a different system to make sure that it stays there. But guys, I want to make sure that if the link keeps disappearing in the last video or this video or all the videos about these packs, please check out my Discord. There is a general tab where you can go to where you can find the link. I will pin the link there. So if this link is not in the description, again, for whatever reason. I'm not going to keep reinserting the whole thing because of course it will be removed after, I don't know, a little while. So make sure to check out Discord. The link is down in the description as well where you can pick up these packs. So with that all the way, guys, if you guys are excited for this video, make sure to smash the like button down below. Subscribe if you're here for the very first time watching. And I would say let's get into this second pack right after the intro. Alright guys, so as you can see right now, we are on Vegas Pro 18. So I just rendered out a really, really small clip of the intro of this video just to show you guys how it all works when you actually want to use these effects. So if you want to go to the first link down in the description, there you can go ahead and click on the download link. But of course, if not, it's also on Discord. I actually also just unzipped everything. So you will download a zip file and you need WinRAR or WinZip in order to extract it. So what you want to do is you want to go ahead and download that first. It's completely for free. And then once you extracted it this is basically what you will see so right here we have number one two three four and five and then you can also see that these are shockwave effects that you can drag into your preview so i'm going to drag this one into my project this is basically what the effect looks like looks really really smooth and we have five different variants that we can use so right now we're going to right click right here and we're going to insert a new video track and we're going to drag this guy on top of it now right here we have the audio i'm going to press u on my keyboard to separate the audio and delete it because of course there isn't audio if you drag it over so this is what it looks like but it's turning black because of course we need to adjust a couple things so one the first thing that you can do is you can just use a chroma key what i would actually recommend is just go to the compositing mode of the track of the shockwave and then you want to click on there and then you want to hit screen because right now anytime you're placing something on this track it will appear like this so right now <laughs> that's a good pause actually so let's go ahead and drag in a different clip the second one of this pack to show you what that looks like all right guys so for the purpose of this video i actually dragged in all of them so right here this is a red one it looks really nice if you want to create a really cool impact right here we have another one kind of like a light blue one then we have a green one which is really really nice and then a black and white one just in case if you want one so that looks really really nice i added in a fade out to these because they actually cut off quite all of a sudden you know that it just goes like this that doesn't look natural so i just added in a fade in for you guys export it so you guys know that you don't have to worry about that so this is how you drag them in and how you use them now if you bring up the actual compositing mode track back to source alpha how it usually was now you can go also use the second method so i'm going to click on the video effects and now right here it says chroma key i'm going to drag on the default onto the first clip then we're going to go ahead and uncheck it for just a second just so we can make sure that it's not like see-through then we're going to click on this blue line you want to pick the pencil you want to click on the black and then you want to re-enable it again and as you can see right now it actually looks pretty decent but it doesn't look like that great and that's because we need to mess with the low and the high threshold so let's bring down the high threshold quite a bit that's going to make it more black but let's go and bring that up and also let's bring also the high threshold as you can see that looks really nice it's going to take away a lot of the black and then you can also mess with the high threshold even with the blur amount if you want to like this to make it a little bit more smooth so let's play it back so this is what it looks like if you use the second method it's kind of looking like a transition right now instead of an effect so that's why just i would actually recommend to use the screen option in your compositing mode right here on the left of the track and that's basically how simple it is guys this is how to use these five really cool shock waves in the previous episode we had all kinds of lower thirds and all things you can use right now we have shock waves i have something really really nice for you guys in store in the next episode so make sure to stay tuned for that all right guys so that's it for this video this is the second pack the download link is in the description guys maybe it will disappear again 
and just like the first video, I don't know what the problem could be. I might reach out to YouTube, but if that's the case, please check out the Discord link in the description. I will pin all the links into the general tab so you can still download it even though YouTube is not showing these links in the description. I have no idea what the problem could be. It's just a standard bit.ly link. It's not just some strange link that YouTube doesn't like. So the link is down below and if not, it is on Discord. Thanks a lot for the continued support guys and I'll see you guys obviously in the next episode.